I wanted to understand, you know, what is your take on AI because today everybody is talking about AI and in your business, in your uh, profile, you know, how do you think, uh, you know, AI uh, plays a role? So, yeah, it definitely is a disruption uh, and, uh, you know, some insights uh, which are available, like, you know, as far as study by PwC, 78% of the CEOs consider uh, their upbeat about AI and uh, uh, however, like, you know, there are other reports as well, like uh, from the Vacancy Global Institute, that AIs might displace around uh, 400 to 800 million jobs by 2030. But it would also create uh, 555 to around 900 million jobs. Uh, so basically, the economy from a AI, uh, generative AI perspective will grow by around uh, 13 trillion dollars, which is like huge by 2030 and all industries will have to move towards adoption so same is the case with even the pharma sector um, and uh, some of the things that are helping us in general in pharma uh, and which is anticipated as well that uh, uh, you know new drug discovery might become more easier because uh, you know it can get more predictable then clinical trials can become more easier uh, because you know, you would exactly know what are the protocols that can be done. That can be uh, helped through AI coming into picture. And of course, I think for every industry, what is true is uh, it would of course help in analytics. It would help in uh, content creation, personalization of content. Some of it in our own lives, we, we can see that it has all, already come in with personal assistance uh, with Alexa or say other uh, other models which are available. Maybe in the near future, we would also see self-driving cars in our own, uh, you know, vicinities. So the actual implications keep is, you know, unfolding and we will have to keep adapting uh, to it. I think that's what our take is. At our own level, I think uh, it would be uh, AI would play a very important role, as I said, you know, but it currently being in pharma, we are using it very uh, judiciously because uh, we need to have the correctness of the data, uh, you know, no infringements, then uh, also to look at from a compliance perspective since it's a highly regulated uh, market.